Good morning, this is Divine Solar Empress and I'm coming to do a reading for the collective. Um, I'm gonna pull on this energy, um, what I've been, ooh, a car fell already. Crime family. This could have something to do with a crime family, but um, the message um, that I got that we're gonna do the reading about is a, a gang stalking couple. Um, it's been coming up in energy. Um, of a couple that gang stalks um, people. So we want to see what this is about. Okay. So we're going to pull in this energy. I didn't pull any signs. Um, I'm going to let the signs kind of come out in um, some of my flashcards if they come out. And then also my tarot. So you pull on that energy of what signs may be involved. Um, yeah. I have looking, it's at the top of the deck, um, looking up your address. Somebody, oh, look, the bottom of the deck is gang stalking. Bottom of the deck, couple gang stalking. It's the bottom of the deck. Top of the deck is looking up your address and get it back in blood. So whoever you are, you're going to get it back in blood, whoever's stalking you. Let me go through this one time. All right, spirit, divine, spirit. G411. Oh, I saw this number this morning when I woke up. 411. Um, it's self-love. Nothing great ever comes to one easy. Follow the higher call, a higher calling. Okay. Let me go through this one more time. Yeah, because I, I got up early this morning and I actually saw that number. So that's a good sign. If you're seeing angel numbers, um, then this may resonate with you. Okay. Let me move these over here. It could be a fake best friend as well that could be involved in this. And somebody's going to have a heart attack on live or while they're doing a live maybe. Okay. All right, so I got all my flash cards that came out. And something could be significant about the super moon. We just had the blue super moon. I did a few readings about the blue super moon. So something significant about maybe this time period. And it could be something involving some type of incest family. Somebody could be having a drug overdose or somebody will have a drug overdose. Um, could be a copycat. I'm so into you. Maybe this person really is into you and no one will be left. So maybe this person is a little crazy. Um, they probably wanted some type of long-term love or there's a long-term love coming to you. And it says the strength of two together. So there could be some type of long-term love coming to you. So we're going to move that over there. This is going to be the karmic couple. Um, look up your address. Oh, yeah, I showed this one already. So somebody could be looking up your address. And um, it could be this gang stalking couple that I picked up in the energy. I will sleep with anyone, male or female. Wow. And this is the heart attack one. Doctor and healer in your past life. So you could have been a doctor or a healer in your past life. And this is a 411. Um, uh, angel number 411. You can look it up as well. Um, take me back. Somebody wants you to take me, take them back. Maybe this could be the stalker and why they're stalking you. Or they could be stalking your significant other or whatever. Um, they will pass away playing with you. So whoever these, this stalker couple is, um, they're going to pass away playing with you. See, stalker couple, prank calls. Yeah, they're going to pass away playing it could be an older person, 40 to 60 years old, or you could be an older person, 40 to 60 years old. So these are probably young people playing then, maybe. Could be a warlock. And I have a malicious woman. So the male could be a warlock, and the woman, she could be a witch or, um, you know, malicious woman, kind of same thing. And um, self-defense, call the police on him. So you may need to defend yourself and call the police on these people. Because they're looking up your address and they seem to not be well. And um, could be a stripper. And whoever this is, they spoke too soon. So maybe calling you or whatever, whoever this is. 
and it says dreams come true. So your dreams are going to come true for whatever you're going through. And so these people are going to have some type of money problems or they are having money problems. That's probably why they're harassing you. He is coming with money, but it is fake. Oh, wow. So somebody's going to come towards you with some money, but it's not real. It's, it's, it's an illusion. They have an insurance policy on you. Oh, wow. He may come. This person may come towards you with insurance money that they got from you or money. I don't know, but well, you'd have to be gone. But um, whatever money they're coming towards you with, it's it's nonsense. How come I keep getting karma? So maybe they're asking how come they keep getting karma. Uh, maybe because you gang stalking somebody or you're not doing the right thing. Mm -hmm. Returning to get my people. And Mega. Ooh, play the Mega. Play the Mega. Play the Mega. You're getting something. So it says, check your credit report. So check your credit report. I saw 6 or 6 on the clock. Check your credit report. Somebody could be messing with your um your credit. Forbidden sex. So this could be a sibling. Of, yeah, see, stepsister is in love with brother and wants to fight women. So this could be this person's stepsister. They have some type of incest family, a crime family, and the sister is harassing you. Lover is in jail and run away now. So whoever this is, it could have a lover in jail as well. And it's some type of sex ritual that they do. So this is a really sick family. Left their family out in the cold. So this person could have left you and your family out in the cold. They ran away now. They're suffering. Oh, wow. Well, whoever this person is with is is uh, uh, calling, uh, prank calling um, your your ex or your spouse. Your parents are leaders, mother or father. So whoever you are, you're getting blessed because your parents are are leaders. Your um your mother or your father is a leader, maybe of a country or some type of political leader. Maybe could even be a governor, mayor, uh, some type of leader, community leader. There's a corrupt judge involved in this and a former mayor. So, yeah, there's some, some government officials in this. That may be who your parents are. Your parents are connected. You are not pretty enough to be a victim. Maybe they're lying and they're saying that you're not pretty enough to be a victim. Um, yeah, so it's a crime family. That was at the bottom. Yikes. Okay. I didn't know victims had to be a certain have a certain look. I mean, anybody could be a victim, but that's okay. <laughs> that's crazy. When I got that download, I wrote it down and I was like, this is a weird download. And I, I haven't seen it come out um, at all, actually. And now it finally came out. So, yeah. That's a lot. Spirit. <laughs> We're going to take the ones that flipped over. Okay, so we have photograph, looking at your photos, missing you, nostalgia, making new memories. So whoever this is, um, they're looking at your photo. That may be why um, this person is uh, gang stalking you because um, whoever they're with, they must want to be with that person. That person's looking at your photo. So they know this person wants you. So that's why they're um, gang stalking you and it seems they have another sibling or they have another they have a male stalking you as well the female does so it's a couple it's a male and female heartbroken deeply hurt sad separation breakup feeling lost yeah grieving mourning so this person is heartbroken that's why they're harassing you Ooh, because you have love coming in i have abundance which is money play the play the mega it's abundance. Keep a positive mindset, manifesting exactly what you want. Gratitude, yes. Yeah. And love, unconditional love, self-love, oneness, passion, affection, and attraction. You are attracting some beautiful stuff. And then wedding rings, union, marriage, soul connection, eternal love, everlasting promise. So you're getting wedding rings. Oh, okay. So you have some abundance. You have some really good stuff coming in for you. So whoever this is is stalking. Uh, it seems to be... Um, oh, I keep looking at this card. It's the top of the deck. It says orphan in the past life. Maybe you were an orphan in your past life, but you're galactic. You have some... And, you're, and your parents are leaders. You have some... Um, 
special um, connection to you is what I'm picking up in this energy. So that may be why you're getting um, uh, stalked. Uh, you could even call it game talking. That may be why you're getting stalked by these people. Okay, this is flipping over, so we're going to take them. Okay, so these two, well, three, these three flipped out. Okay, so you're beautiful, but whoever this is is trying to say that you're not beautiful enough, but beauty came out. So you, maybe you're beautiful to this man. This man thinks you're beautiful, but whoever this hater is, this woman, she says you're not beautiful enough. So she's using, okay, charming, graceful, um, kind-hearted, and you're kind-hearted. So you got a hater that's stalking you. It seems like this may be this male sister or a family member. It's a stepsister. So, oh, psychopath, huh? Breaking point. Yeah. Limit, final straw, overwhelm. So this person's at their breaking point. That's why they're using other people. But you, you're loyal. I see the loyalty card. Trustworthy, reliable, believing. So you, you are loyal. You have loyalty. And you're beautiful, but this is why, okay. So this is why this person's at their breaking point. Because not only are you loyal, you're beautiful. And this person can't take it. That's why they're harassing you. And they're using a male to harass you too. And um, whoever you were connected with or whatever, this person has a life insurance policy on you. And um, this person could be a stripper because the stripper came out. So they may think that they're better than you. But whoever they're with or whoever they're stalking you for, that person thinks you're the ish. Okay? <laughs> and that's why this person's mad. Because this person thinks, oh, because I'm a stripper, I'm supposed to be better. And obviously, you're not if you're harassing a person. <laughs> it's crazy. Emperor at the bottom of the deck. So this could be your emperor who is looking at you and maybe wants to come back and marry you or put a put a ring on. I saw a wedding ring. But if they're dealing with some people that are low vibrational like this, then they need to get their stuff together because they're coming out as an emperor. So hopefully they've ended all cycles because the emperor embodies all kings of the deck. Like the empress embodies all queen of the deck. So this has to be somebody that literally is healed, that's gone through some type of uh, change in their life. Okay, I have the Ace of Cups. So, okay, so this person could be, it could be a new love as well. This person is bringing in a love offer. I mean, the Ace of Cups is a love offer, marriage. This is proposal. It could even be a new baby coming. Ooh, and the Six of Wands, victory, success, public recognition. Hey, that made me want to do the, man, you got some good stuff coming. This is good news. This is good fortune day. Look at that. The Ace of Cups and the Six of Wands. You got some victory coming in. You got some good stuff, okay? Ooh, this open to the Five of Pentacles. So whoever this is, they're, they're okay, so that's why they're, they're, they're experiencing some type of lack. I have the Five of Pentacles. So they could be in some type of financial loss or you were in a financial loss. But uh, yeah, so they could be having some type of poverty, maybe... They have low self-esteem or something. This is why the stripper is doing this. And then I have the Eight of Wands. Okay, so something fast is coming. Some type of fast movement. So something is coming. Oh, this King of Swords. Oh, this is an air sign. So this King of Swords could be coming towards you. Because I have the Eight of Wands. So this King of Swords could be coming towards you fast. Or poverty is coming towards this King of Swords fast. And that's the truth. Ace of Swords. Wait a minute. Ooh. I think poverty is coming towards this King of Swords. Because I got the Five of Pentacles, Eight of Wands, King of Swords, Ace of Swords. So this lack, this poverty, whatever this is, is this this is like literally out in the cold query. Is it's it's and then the eight of wands, some type of movement, something's coming towards this this king of swords, and that's a confirmation from the universe. Ace of um, ace of swords, and then I have the king of wands. So up here you have an emperor who's bringing in love. 
public recognition success down here you have a king of swords and a king of wands and I, after the king of wands you have the ten of wands which means this person is burdened this person is weighed down and oh the hermit because they're oh they're soul searching so whatever these two gentlemen are they going through it there's and i have an earth sign a fire sign i got two fire air yeah this could have it feels like two separate energies. It doesn't feel like the same energy. This is two males. Or this woman could be coming up in that in that um that male energy. They could be in their, their masculine energy. But the couple was two feet is a male and a female couple was the energy that I got. But these two energies is an air sign and a fire sign. King of Wands, King of Swords. I have them burdened and I have uh, the Five of Pentacles, which is financial lack. And it's coming at them fast. They're burdened. And then I have the Ten of Swords. This is a painful ending. Look at all those knives in this back. This is That's a painful ending. So they're, they're going within about this painful ending and this money, whatever's going on with them. Yeah. So there is a king of pentacles in your midst and they are coming with some type of nine of cups. So it could be some type of wish fulfillment for you. See, I have the king of pentacles here. So this emperor could be a businessman. Could be He could be a king of pentacles. That's an earth sign. And the emperor is obviously a fire sign. Um, yeah. Some type of businessman or something with uh he is it's a well it's a well off gentleman basically a male energy um and then i have the nine of cups so they could be coming with some type of you know wish fulfillment for you literally dreams come true stability so they're coming towards you with the ace of cups and the nine of cups and that's your justice that's justice that's my that's the air energy oh wow Okay, so this, wait a minute, this Queen of Pentacles, I have a Queen of Pentacles, this Queen of Pentacles could be the ex of this King of Pentacles, because before this Queen of Pentacles was the devil energy, that's attachment. That's that dark side, that shadow side. That's toxicity, codependency. This may be, this queen of pentacles may be the person that is pranking you, that is calling you. And it seems like she has two other males in her midst. And I know one of them is, is the one that's on the phone harassing you with her because it was a couple that was doing the, the harassment. And they're under judgment. This queen of pentacles... Oh, so this is the woman that's with this this emperor, this king of pentacles. Now they're the two of swords. <laughs> wow. So yeah, they're under judgment. Mm. So there's some type of stalemate, maybe a stagnation or something. Oh, to the giving and receiving. So this this king of pentacles may have stopped giving to this this queen of pentacles. That's why she is using these two gentlemen to, to harass and to do something. But my King of Swords is my cop card as well. So it could be law enforcement involved as well. So just to, I just want to make that clear. It could be a lawyer, some type of authority figure. You know what I'm saying? But they're in a painful ending. They're in a judgment. And it's a, it's a two of swords. It's basically weighing your options. It's a stalemate to this giving and receiving the six of pentacles. Stopped. Yeah. Oh, because you've healed. The star is healing. Having faith. You've healed or this king of, this king of pentacles is healed. He's healing himself. That's an air sign. Oh, okay. So you could be a hierophant. 
You could be maybe some type of teacher, religious leader, or this could even be, you know, the creator is healing this with the Hierophant. But the Hierophant, is, it could be an institution, it could be a leader, it's a, it's, it's a religious idea, it's a mentality as well. You know, like a, a re religious belief as well, that's what I'm saying. Okay, so you're coming up as a queen of, wait a minute, queen of pentacles? No, queen of cups, I'm sorry. Yeah. So it's some type of religious, because I have the queen of cups coming out. In illusions. Hmm. Damn, y'all got you got a lot of people in your energy. This Queen of Cups has come out. Hmm. You know what? Let me because I'm gonna pull on, I'm gonna do it like this. I'm gonna pull on these signs individual sorry this reading gonna be a little bit longer because it's a collective and i really want to understand because i noticed in a lot of my signs a lot of my readings i've been getting these is so many people in the energy that it's almost kind of becoming um people are cloaking themselves as well it, it's a lot in these energy and i want to clarify some of this okay so with this um queen of cups i want to know um oh, i'm sorry i put those backwards i want to pull on this queen of cups energy because i want to understand is this the woman that's being attacked or is this one of the people is this the woman that's calling It came out with the King of Cups and the Four Pentacles. Hmm. See, with the Four Pentacles, it's it's scarcity. It's it's like, but it could be like some type of solid foundation as well. Maybe they're trying to save. Yeah, they're going through something. Because it came they came out as a couple. And it opened to the three of swords. So this could be this could this could be the couple. But why did they come out as a king and queen of pen? There's multiple people in y'all energy. That's crazy. Okay, I'm sorry. Give me something on this King of Swords. Who's this King of Swords? What's, what's, give me something on this King of Swords. So with the King of Swords, it's transition, moving on, leaving behind. They're releasing baggage. And then I have the Wheel of Fortune. So I have the Six of Swords and the Wheel of Fortune. Okay. So we know the couple is a king and queen of cups. That's who this couple's coming out as. Yeah. So they're slowing down this teamwork. I got the three of pentacles. So that's teamwork. But I, I have the knight of pentacles, which is, is kind of like slow and steady. You know, finances and is slow and steady. They're moving slow and steady. So maybe their money is slowed down. That's why they're in lack. So now they're harassing you. And behind it is the Eight of Swords in reverse. So it, it basically, it, it's limited beliefs. Like it's restriction normally upright, but in, inside it's like religious, it's, um, excuse me, it's uh, limited beliefs. Like inside it's internal. It could be anger. You know what I'm saying? In reverse. Yeah. Oh, because of money. <laughs> Sorry. It could be negative thoughts. It could be because of this Ten of Pentacles. Because behind it is the Ten of Pentacles. And then it's the Seven of Wands. So, you know, that's literally trying to maintain control. That's like trying to defend. But they're in a Nine of Swords. They're in anxiety, worry, lack. 
They're trying to balance this out. Okay, give me something. Oh, I was saying, give me something on this King of Swords and the Knight of Pentacles came out. So something is, is, is slowing down. It's not coming fast enough. Maybe this King of Swords isn't moving fast enough. Okay, give me something on this King of Swords. Ooh, okay. So I have the higher font. So maybe they're going within. There's an internal uh, soul searching a little bit. That's the higher font came out with this King of Swords. And then I have the Temperance Angel. So some type of balance, harmony um, is coming in to balance this out. Oh, they could be in financial. They're stuck. I have the Hangman, which is stuck. Um, their finances, they're, they're in lack. The Five of Pentacles. So they could be stuck and in lack. Their finances have slowed down. Wow, okay. So they could be going through something. Their finances could have slowed down. Okay, give me something on this King of Wands. Let me see this King of Wands. This King of Wands. What's going on with this King of Wands? Okay, I saw something flip over. Oh, the Sun card. Hmm. Something's going to be illuminated about this King of Wands. Something's going to be shown. Or maybe they have a positive outlook or something. But the king, the sun is always my illumination card. Just like the moon is, uh, you know, illusions. My, ooh, we Same thing. It's the same thing. The Knight of Pentacles, this, this is slow down, slow and steady, slow to come in. I have the higher font, so they could be some type of religious leader. This could be the warlock. He could be a dark, you know, warlock. I'm sorry, but this, this could be some type of, you know, belief system. But the teamwork, they were working together. So they probably were working with this couple. And then I have, again, the Eight of Swords reversed. That's anger. That's, that's, you know, limited self-beliefs. And with this coming out with the Hierophant, that's why I said, it's something in their belief system has really got them messed up. It's whatever's in their belief system. It's whatever they're believing. It could have been some type of lie or something that could have been told. But whatever they're doing, they're coming at, I, talk, I saw 27, 27. They're coming at, um yeah. They're coming at this woman. You know what? Let me pull on this. Um, okay, let me pull on this stripper. Because I have this stripper card. This is a stripper. I, I want to pull on this stripper. Okay, I'm going to pull all these back in here. Who is this stripper? Is Give me something on this stripper. I have the Knight of Wands inverted. Oh, wow. I have the Two of Pentacles and the Knight of Wands was inverted. Okay. Oh, wow. Okay. So, I have the Two of Pentacles is obviously juggling. And it could be some type of news as well. It's um, maybe some type of negotiation or something going on with this stripper. But with the Knight of Wands, that's like, you know, fearless movement. It could be, you know, sex-driven as well. Charming. And then I have the Eight of Cups, which is basically walking away, leaving behind. And then I have the Six of Cups, which is some type of childhood memories, nostalgia maybe or something. So what I'm trying to figure out is... Did, did your ex know this stripper since they were children? And, you know, maybe she became a stripper and he linked back up with her or something. But she seems to be, um, it's money related. And he, whoever this is, is juggling with this person. Like money, everything is slowed down. Money, it's, it's something to do with money. They're juggling money. But now they have to leave this behind or they left the stripper behind. Okay. 
because it seems to be this is maybe the stripper. It could even be their sibling. It seems to be the person that is pranking, um, and she has a male with her. Yeah. It's lovers. So I have the Knight of Cups. So maybe you came at this woman like you were some type of knight in shining armor or something. You came at her like you were Mr. Charming. But now you're you're in the Nine of Wands. Like literally, that's defense. You're weary. You're trying to hold yourself, stand ground, defend something. Or she thinks she is. Because I have the lovers. So that's why I said maybe you she thinks that she's your lover. She obviously she's trying to she's trying to defend this and then i have the five of swords that's conflict that's literally you somebody's trying to win at all costs like i said she has a male using um she, she's using another male to harass um your your ex or your mate i have the seven of pentacles so I mean, this means these people were most likely, they were working hard at this, or they've been doing this for a while. Now they have to walk away, but they're heartbroken. It's the three of swords. They're heartbroken. Maybe she's been with you for a long time, or she's been, because it's a sibling involved. Maybe your sibling is a stripper, and you guys mess with each other or something. I, I'm sorry, but that's just what the energy is putting out. It's a step-sibling. And I have the six of swords. So that's transition, moving on, leaving behind. It's another leaving behind card. Another walking away card. Because the Eight of Cups is disappointment, abandoning. You're literally escaping. And then I have the Six of Swords, which is another transition card, like leaving it all behind. But it's the wheel. The Wheel of Fortune is here. It's a completion and the sun. So it's going to get illuminated. It's going to be shown. And then I have the Eight of Swords. Yeah, now it's in now it's in the upright. So this is some type of imprisonment. Somebody could be feeling isolated. Yeah. This is also my prison card. So, yeah, from this teamwork. Yeah, Three of Pentacles from the teamwork. And that's what I said, the Hierophant again. This is some type of belief system. Whatever they've been in, maybe they believed that they could be with their family or something, or he could give to both because it's the Six of Pentacles. This is some belief that he could juggle both. He could give to both, giving and receiving. You see, he's giving to both. Maybe he believed that he could be married and have this, have his sibling on the side, his step sibling on the side. It's some type of belief system in here, but it's judgment on it. Yes, judgment on this Queen of Pentacles. She came out again. Queen of Pentacles. As I said, it was the money. It's judgment on her money. It's whoever she is, it's judgment on her. Whatever she's doing, she has judgment on her. And the devil is behind her. The devil's behind her. That's attachment codependency. That's why I said it she could be it's, they could be in business together also. They could, they, they could have some type of structure or something together where they believe that they could have somebody on the outside, but they still mess with each other in the family. That's what I said. It's a crime family. They do crime together. They're connected. 33, 33 on the clock. The magician. That's what I said. They probably get together, do spell work. They do stuff together. It's the magician is is literally manifesting creation. Just it, it, you know, it, it's it's all that. Yeah. But they don't pretty much manifested the seven of swords. It's betrayal, it's theft, it's bullies. This is bullies. This is bullies. That's theft, trickery, fraud, seven pentacles. Three of cups, celebration. Yeah. It's a defeat. Seven of swords, that's, my, that's what I call my bullies. It's defeat, it's theft, it's dishonesty. trickery
But whoever you are, this the world is here. This is the ending of the cycle. This is a completion of this nonsense, of this betrayal, this this theft, fraud, whatever this 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 seems to be. Um, this group. So you could be a queen of swords. It's an air energy. Libra, Gemini, Aquarius. But that's a person who speaks truth very blunt. Okay, so you have a message coming in. I have the Page of Pentacles. This is a message. It could be some type of new love, something coming in. A message about something maybe being given to you as well. It's, it's, it's like a new message, new opportunity. Oh, it's coming fast too. I got the Knight of Swords. So it's coming in fast. Could be some type of truth. Some oh, it's love. Okay, Ace of Cups. So you have some some marriage proposal, some type of love coming in towards you, um, fast. Queen of Swords, and it came. The Ace of Cups came out again with the Six of Wands. That's what I'm trying to. You have some type of victory, success, love. Whoever this emperor is, they're coming towards you with something wonderful, and it's the Ten of Cups behind it. So they're coming in with this happy. If you're, you're getting something amazing coming to you. You're getting a happy family, some type of victory, success, and play the mega. Like you're getting something wonderful coming towards you. And the King of Pentacles again. This King of Pentacles is this emperor. Because it come, it came, all this came out. The only thing wasn't in it was this Ten of Cups. Now this Ten of Cups is in the middle of it. They're coming at you with all that. This Ace of Cups, ooh, we, and it's your justice. This is your justice. And the Nine of Pentacles, ooh, that's fruits of your labor. That's luxury, baby. That's financial stability. Ooh, we, with the Eight of Pentacles, too. So this is basically for your hard work. This is because you've been diligently moving forward, taking care of yourself, doing everything you need to do, Empress. Yeah, you're an air sign. But Empress is also, um, it could be a Taurus as well. It could be a Taurus or a Libra. But anybody could embody an Empress. But yeah, that's abundance. This is like a motherly figure, abundance. This is all queens of the deck. So whoever you are, you're getting a nine of pentacles, the ten of cups, it's your justice. You're getting the ace of cups, six of wands. So you got victory, success come. And that came out twice, Queen of Swords. Ooh, we you not playing with them. Whoever this high priest is in reverse, because this high priestess came out in reverse. Whoever this high priestess is, is in reverse, she need to go sit down. Because I got the four cups, so she don't wait to set her butt down. This is literally, go sit your butt down. Disconnected. She don't wait and sit down. She need, she need a break. She need to reevaluate. Because she, she bored or something. Yep, here it is. <laughs> I got the four cups and the four swords. That's rest. Yeah, she need to go sit her butt down. She need to go calm down. She got the four swords and the four cups. She need to go take a break. That literally both is... Rest and taking a break, reevaluate, and go sit down. You should, somebody ain't happy. Oh, from all the spying, the page of swords. So from the spying, look, you probably gonna get some info about this person spying. Like I said, they they it's a couple that's prank calling, uh, harassing somebody. But whoever this king of swords is, this person is stuck. The hangman came out with him. So this person need a new perspective or something. Look, King of Swords, Hangman, they stuck. That surrender stuck. Whatever they got going on, they are. And it's a King of Wands in here, but now they fighting. It's the Five of Wands. This is competition, fighting, all that. Oh, with the Two of Swords again, with the Ten of Swords. So that's literally a painful ending. Like I said, they in some type of stalemate. They in a painful ending. Ooh, with the page of wands. So it could, like I said, it could be something happening on live. Like you won't get a message about it or some type of news. But there, they, look, two of swords, ten of swords, page of wands, some type of message in a tower. 
a tower to this ace of pentacles that abundance whatever they thought they was getting is 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 it's a tower and the queen of wands Ooh, it's coming fast towards them too with this queen of cups and this king of cups these are the people that's involved these are the people that's involved Ooh, we mm. that's this couple they got they got you getting gang stalked you got multiple people in your energy and it seems to be couples because I had the, the the knight of um excuse me I had the king of wands and the queen of wands finally came out uh queen of cups king of cups and there's a king of swords in here too I don't know, but this is 40 minutes. But whoever this is, this is somebody's sibling is involved. This is a step sibling as well. So uh they they gang stalking somebody. And this is 40 minutes. This is long enough. Um, this is the My Solar Empress 333. Please like and subscribe. Um, I'm gonna put the video up. It's gonna be a couple uh gang stalking couple. So, you know, like that's what I picked up in the energy. But I'm keep looking down at this. It says no closure. So whoever this is, they don't it's unforgiving and no closure. This person is seems to be uh, having some problems. They're doing jar spells as well. This is jar spells. And all who touch your things will pay. So they're gonna pay. Like I said, get it back in blood. And she is your problem. So whoever this lady is, she's your problem. Um, but your ancestors. Or on the way. So. Yikes. Anyway. I thank you so much. Please like and subscribe. Thank you.